there's a lot of things you don't eat, and there's a lot of things you do eat. But uh-huh. you like salad. Yes. Salad's mm. fun. Big salad fan. Can't really screw up a salad for you. Nope. Unless you put some bacon on it or something like that. That's the only way you're going to ruin a salad. But if you make your own salad. Yeah, which I do. You're not going to screw it up. No. So you're going to be fine with that. So a woman in Seattle went to her favorite restaurant and said, you know, give me a salad to go. Mm -hmm. Because I'll take the salad back home and and or take it back to work and that's going to be my lunch i'm gonna eat the salad so she went to her favorite salad lunch spot picked up the salad on wednesday went to er, uh, work to eat it while she was eating it she went "Mm, mm, mm, something's not right here Uh uh-oh so she's working she's she's like hmm oh god She, she looks at it and there's an arm what and then there's guts no oh my god it was a lizard. No. Oh, ew. And in, she ate it. In her salad. Oh, God. Oh, God. I may never eat again. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> and she, you know, I what's worse? I can't, I can't hear any more of this. No, you have I'm, to because it only gets better. Dogs. <laughs> it only gets better. Oh, um, God. So, <laughs> oh Jesus, I can't even, please don't let me even, I can't look at this. So what's worse? Don't wor- show me okay, the video. I took the, I took it down. What's worse than finding a lizard in your salad? Finding half a lizard half in your salad. Half a lizard yes, in your uh-huh. salad. Right. Oh, this is so gross. So now they're saying, okay, they went back to the restaurant and said, whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a uh-huh. lizard in your salad. Stop what you're doing. Close the restaurant down. This is not good. This is a safety hazard. And the yeah, salad, I would pe- think <laughs> it's a health hazard. No, the salad people said, mm, it's not really that big a thing. There's <gasps> things in salad all the time. What? So the place that we get the salad from, they let things go. Sometimes snakes, oh my God. mice, spiders, <gasps> sometimes live things in there. Ah. The positive thing is they really don't cause human illness. Most of the time, most of the time, I don't know. I want a hundred percent of the time, no illness, but the staff should have looked at the salad before they sent Ugh. it out and yeah. did, you know, the, the last check. And they said, we're going to go to the company and say, you know what? You got to wash it one more time before you send it out. You know, now I'm thinking of all the times I've ordered salad at a restaurant and right before they served it to me, they picked a lizard out or a frog or something. Or a spider, sometimes yeah. live. Right. Ooh. She's not going to get 10% off her next uh, uh, car insurance. <laughs> <laughs> the lizard, the get-go. <laughs> the, 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 the lizards get mad. Um, but my thing is, so they say, well, this company washes the salad three times uh-huh. before they send it to us. Right. So why doesn't the restaurant wash it just yet another time one more time just one more time wash it take a look at it you know be, have it, even before you serve it even before you give it to a customer just take a little peek in it just a little look see hey how's the lettuce is it crawling around no good it can go yeah because if you order a steak they have to prepare it cook it then serve it for a salad you really don't do anything except for take it out of one bowl put it in another bowl and then send it out. At least but, wash no, they, it. There's something wrong with them. I, I call BS on this. I've worked in a lot of restaurants in my day. I mean, a lot of restaurants. My entire beginning of my life, I was a waitress. I worked in kitchens. I have never, and I worked in New York City, mm-hmm. never seen anything like this in lettuce or food. No one has ever pulled. One time, I saw a roach crawling out of a closet, and they shut down the restaurant and they cleaned everything down to make sure there were no roaches anywhere. I have never seen any of that stuff in food. Never. And Uh, I've worked in a lot of crappy restaurants in New York city. Okay. 30, 40 years ago, we got the lettuce from the guy down the street. It wasn't 30, 40 years ago. No, I'm (laughs) saying, I'm saying (laughs) back in the day, back not when you were working, but thank you. (laughs) 14 years ago, they got the lettuce from the guy down the street. They got local lettuce from the farmers. Now they're importing lettuce from God knows where. Okay. So you're getting your food, not from the guy down the street, 
but from a different country. That's where lizards come from. Mm-hmm. So the lizard is going, hey, this is my food. Nobody really touches it. A machine picks all that lettuce and nobody looks through it. Okay. My boyfriend would be listening to this right now and saying, you know where there's no lizards? In steak. Mm-hmm. In hot dogs. Well, hot dogs uh, probably hot have dogs lizards. Have yeah, lizards. they probably have lots of lizards, but you don't see them. <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee there's more <laughs> more things than just lizards and hot dogs. It's true. It's a good point. <laughs> but no, your boyfriend has to hear this now, and he's got to go through every piece of kale, lettuce, whatever comes into that house to make sure there's not a lizard. Oh, you know I will. I am. I will. I will be going through my food with a fine tooth comb. You know what? I may stop eating. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is what you know people are like don't eat junk food you know where there's no lizards in a bag of potato chips mm-hmm. see and <laughs> you complain and bitch and moan about i want my food a certain way <laughs> you don't know what kind of animal is going to crawl in there and you're going to eat it yeah there's no spiders in my chocolate bars then you got to figure out how many spiders you have eaten in your sp- chocolate bar your whole life there's got zero be- i don't know about that yeah, we're getting lettuce from different countries now. This is going to happen more and more.